with the gold from Japan, Shoma Uno. His teammate Sota Yamamoto takes the silver, and South Korea's Junwon Cha receives the bronze. Surprising no one, Uno is yet again numero uno, this time by 22 points. But it was definitely a journey getting there. Big fall on the quad toe resulting in no combo will leave him in second by five points as he heads into the free. Like the rest of the event, it was not a clean skate for Shoma, popping a quad flip into a double. However, his other four quads and two triple axles were executed with ease and command. That, married with his unmatched skating style and sensitivity, highlighted in elements like his choreo and step sequence, really clinched the gold for him this time. Although I did see judge number one give him a 7.75 in presentation. A little bit of a, mm, what you doing there, girl, or guy, or however you self-identify. Just because he's Shoma Uno and he always brings it when he skates, uh, and a 7.75 is something really low for a skater his caliber. It won't hurt him too much because the lowest point does get thrown out in that average, but still, What's up? <laughs> Good enough to score a season's best 188.10 for a total of 279.76. Leading after the short program, Yamamoto will skate last in the free and will have to deliver a skate of the lifetime after Shoma put up huge points. He looks unfazed as he warms up this free with three authoritative quads, then Trouble decides to join the party and he has falls on both triple axle attempts. Finished six in the free, but his massive short score kept him in medal contention. Silver in Japan and his silver in France get him a spot at the Grand Prix final. And while Yamamoto finished six in the free, Chun Wan Cha of South Korea sat six after the short. The Korean came back with a vengeance in the free, lands two of the best quads I have ever seen Jun Wan do, ends his next to clean James Bond free with that signature outside in a bower, and hits a big boy Ting's ending position while he receives a standing ovation from the crowd in Sapporo. His best free skate of the season so far puts him in second in the segment, and he bounces out of Japan with his second bronze medal of the year. Now, these three medalists are looking pretty good for their chances to head to the Grand Prix final, but we still have one event next week, so it will be a wait and see. And speaking of the Grand Prix final, Tomono Kazuki from Japan finished fourth, and Adam Xiaohimfa of France finished fifth, so both of them are on the bubble for Italy. I know you love that video, so subscribe so you don't miss any more, and you're sitting here anyways, watch some more.